Hi guys, um, so one of the DIYs that I w really wanted to do for Vlogmas was making my own stocking and I happened to find this piece of fabric, it's like a shawl or something, um, at a de Grenier this summer for two euros. Um, so I'm going to make it out of this and I'm going to try to cut carefully so I can make it zero waste and turn the rest of the fabric into little pouches and clutches and things like that. Um, I've made myself kind of a really sketchy pattern. I'll link in like a proper pattern below, but basically I want to cut this out and I'm going to take it downstairs to the tailors because I don't have a sewing machine and I was going to hand stitch it, but I'd really like to have these kind of last a lifetime if possible. So um, I'm going to take it to the tailors to get it sewn, which is kind of cheating, but it's supposed to be made to last. So I've placed the pattern basically in a way so that I'm going to use create the least amount of waste possible. I'm going to be creating a cuff with the fringy part of the fabric um, and I'm going to do one side right side out and the other side which is also really pretty fabric um, the other way around. Um, and then I'm going to decorate it with some um, eco-friendly organic uh, ethically made pom-poms that I got on Etsy which I'll link in below and then this vintage sort of off cut of um, pom-poms that I found and then I've got some embroidery thread and stuff like that as well, so we'll see. Um, and I'm in my running clothes because I'm going to try and multitask and <laughs> bring the fabric down whilst before I go for a run. Um, so yeah, so when I come back, I'll, I should have the, the stocking made and I will um, show you how I'm going to decorate it and stuff like that. Anyway, I will see you soon. So the lady who made the stocking did a really good job. I'm really happy with how it turned out. And then I just hand sewed on some of the pom-poms. I ended up only using a few um, and I thought it looked pretty cute. And then I made the hangy thingy out of some scraps from the fabric and just sewed it on separately after the stocking was already made. I've got the full tutorial on my blog, which you'll find via the link below. If you have any questions, just put them in the comments. I'm wishing you a beautiful day, and I will see you soon. Bye.